It's your girl, Judy. Today is Easter Sunday. And uh, it's raining here. And uh, we did our Easter egg uh, hunt yesterday. And um, I want to make some donuts for the kids. And uh, I'm going to start off with two cups of all-purpose flour. Okay, and a half teaspoon of salt. And I'm gonna mix it up well. This is how my um, dad and mama met up there in uh, A&M College. She had her donuts warming on a uh, heater and he stole them. So this is how they met in the a and College. And that's up there in Huntsville. Yeah, he stole her donuts, the uh, donut bandit. So I can make donuts now, Daddy. At least I'm going to try to make donuts. Okay, I'm going to put this to the side. Half a cup of warm milk. Half a tablespoon of dry yeast. Three teaspoons of sugar. Wait a minute, I didn't get all that yeast out of there. I need all that yeast. Two teaspoons of melted butter. One large egg. And a teaspoon of vanilla flavor. Okay. And we're going to mix that together real good. And that vanilla flavor is smelling really, really good. No, I'm not cooking dinner today. I'm going to sit around and reflect on the things in life. I'm not having a dinner today. I'll probably go to one of my girls and get dinner from them for me and my husband. Okay. Get that all mixed up. Now I'm going to bring that flour back in here. And I'm going to pour... Uh, Make a hole down in the middle there so I can pour it in. Make sure it's good and mixed up. Okay. I'm going to mix it around in there. Let me move this out the way because I'm going to have to put some flour down there. So I can work with my hands. Yeah, I done bought that yeast and I'm making bread all over the place. At least I'm trying to make bread. I found about three packs of yeast. At, uh, no, I bought about three packs at uh, a little local grocery store called uh, Save a Lot. Because Walmart and the Piggly Wiggly were out of yeast. I guess that's like that uh, toilet tissue. They buying up all the yeast. So I happened to find some yeast in uh, 
save a lot. And I bought me some. About three packs. Okay. I'm going to get it all off that spoon there. I mean that whip. And now I'm going to pour a little flour. On my board. And I'm going to mash it all together here and get me a dough ball, okay? And I'll come back when I get this in a ball, okay? Okay, I've got it all mixed together, I guess, and all kneaded up. Now I'm going to put it on this board. Okay, I will interrupt it again. Every time my phone rings, my video goes off. But I needed that flour for about maybe, for about five minutes. Then I'm gonna put a little oil in that bowl. I'm gonna get better with this. I'm going to put a little oil on my hand. And now. And I'm going to sit it in the middle of the bowl. I'm going to put some saran wrap on top. And I'm going to sit it over there in that corner and let it rise. It's going to get twice as big as the ball in there. Okay? I'm going to let it rise. And I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. Uh, I am back. Taking the saran wrap off of the uh, plastic. And I have washed my hands. And I'm going to punch it down. Ooh, the yeast smells so good. Throwing it on the flour board. And look, I'm going to have to get me a little rolling pin since I'm going to be making bread. Okay, we're going to roll it out not too thin. Because I'm going to let them rise a little bit after I punch them out. Okay? I'm thinking it's just too big. But, no, it's not. It's not too big. Now, remember, this is my first time making donuts. Okay? And I'm going to try to get 12. Like in a dozen. This is really my first time making bread. I'm not a bread maker. Okay. Then I found this little cap. But I'm going to punch the hole in the middle. Move my hand so you can see. Okay. 
okay. Well, that one didn't go all the way down. No. There. Okay. Pulling the little hole, donut hole out. And I'm going to sit it on the side right there. Because I'm going to have to let them rise a little bit more. Okay. And, uh. I will be back to let you see how they turn out. Okay. Take the donut holes and put them on the side because I might have to roll them back up to make more donuts because I'm going to get 12 donuts. And I don't know why I'm so afraid of yeast. Making donuts with yeast or making bread with yeast. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I am making the, uh, the, uh, Icing for the donuts. And I'm going to add confectionery sugar. And I'm going to add the milk like a tablespoon at a time. Until I get a smooth consistency of, uh, the icing. And I'm going to add like a teaspoon of vanilla flavor. And I'm going to stir it around. I'm going to add another teaspoon of milk and I'm gonna get it all stirred up good like that I hope these donuts turn out good okay and there it is that's all it takes and I'll be right back I'm fixing to drop these donuts now okay guys I'm gonna drop a donut hole in there first. And it's still not hot enough. I turned it up a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and drop a donut. Two, three, oh, four. Okay, there you go. It looks like they're going to turn out pretty good, okay? I've never made donuts before. Never made bread. I guess the yeast makes them rise even more. And uh, if I can do it, you can do it. Okay, I'm going to go away and come back and let y'all see how they turn out. Okay, y'all, they floating around in that grease. They doing pretty good, I think. And see my donuts over there? 
Now, I'm going to say it again. This is the first time I've ever made donuts, and they, they look like they're going to turn out pretty good. Now, I'll be right back. Okay, guys. Here are my homemade donuts. And uh, I think they turned out good. I haven't tried them yet. I'm going to try a little donut hole in the back here. They pretty good. They taste like maybe a day old donut. <laughs> now this is my first time making donuts now. They taste like maybe a day old donut. They don't taste like fresh, fresh donuts. But I let them cool down before I put the uh, glaze on top. And um, I'm gonna get better. You remember I said, I, I, if I make a mistake, i let you know. Maybe I needed them too much. Uh, maybe that's what happened. But they pretty good now. I mean, they're good. But still, they taste like day-old donuts. And you want a fresh donut, like one-day donut. And, uh... They'll do my first time. Subscribe, like, and comment to my donut video. I'm going to get better. You're going to look at this like two years from now and say, Damn, them donuts look good now. But they didn't look good like two years ago. Okay? Y'all ain't got to go home. Oh, stay humble. Please stay humble. Be blessed. And y'all have a good day. I'm going to break one of these open for you. See? Y'all have a good day. Y'all ain't got to go home, but you got to get out of here with my day-old donuts. Bye for now.